The Origin Story of Rainbow Steve The origin story of Rainbow Steve begins when he was created in a lab. Rainbow Steve would first start his journey by waking up in the lab where the elders created him. He was lost, confused, and scared. No one was around to help him understand the situation he was in. Why am I in this tube under water? Why are those lights flickering up there in... What, what, what was that? Oh gosh, wait. Where, where am I? Um... I don't know if I want to go through that. Oh my gosh. Okay, um... Okay, here goes nothing. Better get ready to face what's ever out there. Uh, yeah! There's nothing. Hello? Anyone? It's just some weird looking square thing in the center and some paintings? What are what are these things? Oh wait, this is that place I was looking at before. Wait, there's where I was! Not just a, a few minutes ago. And I was looking up at this, but what is this? Unknown to him, Elder Steves from all colors of the rainbow had come together in an attempt to create a hero that would be powerful enough to defeat the greatest evil of their time, Nightmare Steve. In order to create Rainbow Steve, the elders fused almost all of their power together in turn sacrificing themselves for the future of their people. He was in a delicate state and eventually found his way out of the lab to the outside world. He had made good timing too because as he left, the lab exploded and barely reached him, only knocking him out. Gosh, I just have so many questions like, I don't know, why did I just come out at the side of a mountain or something? I, I don't get it. Oh my gosh! What is, what, what's happening? Oh my gosh, it keeps, Oh my gosh! What's happening? Oh my gosh! Rainbow Steve would wake up to find that a green Steve had saved him and took him back to his house, which was an old tree of life, one of the life sources of the Steves. Oh, my head. Ugh, gosh, what is that? Weird crackling noise. Wait, where? Where, where, where am I? What is this place? This is so nice. Did were you the one who rescued me from that place? I don't remember much from it. It was kind of all of a blur, actually. And where, where am I? Y you found me in a ditch and rescued me. Well, thank you very much for that. But where, where am I, Green Steve? I. I don't recognize any of this, and I'm in your house. Oh, we have a very nice house, then. This is really nice, actually. Look at all Well, thank you for rescuing me, but I, I guess I didn't really ask my question well enough. I'm not... Well, I, I guess I should start off with saying I don't really remember anything, like, at all. Like, the last thing, I, the first thing and the only thing I remember was me waking up inside that place. It was at this time that Rainbow Steve would begin to learn the biggest problem of the world. The king of evil himself, Nightmare Steve. He had come to the Green Steve's house to attack them. Terrified, the two decided to run to gather more help. Hey, hey, you, yeah, yeah, you Nightmare Steve or whatever you're called. Stop bullying my friend! Uh, uh, new Steve, I'll end like, what do you mean I'll end like the rest of them? That doesn't make any sense. I, I, I don't- Whoa! Wait. I, I'm, I'm, I'm okay? Huh? What? Yeah! Get, 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 get I, I don't want another fireball in my face. Um, run! We, we do need help. Okay, well, maybe we should look to find, I don't know, other Steves. Like, like, what if the Red Steves? Yeah, they, the Red Steves wouldn't like it if they, um, knew that night I mean they probably know that Nightmare Steve obviously took one of their Red Steves and fused with him so maybe we should go to them I know they're aggressive maybe they'll help us fight yeah that sounds like something they do maybe I don't know I've never met a Red Steve before do you think they'll help maybe it's risky though yeah I guess so because they are the most aggressive Steves but 
I think that's our best option, honestly. Throughout his journey, Rainbow Steve would come to befriend more allies, such as a Red Steve, Elder Blue Steve, a New Blue Steve, and a Purple Steve. I, I don't think anyone's home. Should we go? Oh, hello. How are you? Oh, whoa! 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 Green Steve, run, run, run! Run, run, run! Okay, run, 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 run! He's punching me! Why is he punching me? Green Steve, why is he punching us? I'm so confused. We, we got you flowers. See? See? Flowers. Well, he's not punched us yet. What, what is he doing? He, wait, he's looking at them. Yeah, th th that's definitely a good sign. He uh, has not punched us. Um. Y y y is he okay? We dropped some redstone. He does seem happy. Oh, hey, hey, Red Steve. Oh, yeah, he seems very happy. Um, hey, Red Steve, can we c come? Okay, um, I guess that means go inside. Come on, come on, Green Steve. But with new allies, he would also meet new enemies. Trying to deal with Nightmare Steve, the allies would come to witness the creation of their new enemy, Dark Steve. He was created by Nightmare Steve to be a right-hand man, able to do the work Nightmare Steve didn't want to do. Blue Steve, what is that? Looks like he made what? What did he make? A dark Steve? Oh no. Oh no, what do we do? This is bad. I don't know, he just disappeared. I... What? Oh! He's moving! The dark Steve is moving! I don't know. We, oh. Uh. He hello. H hi. Oh. Um. Hi. Uh. Y how how are you doing? What? I'm just trying to make conversation. Oh, it's you guys. What do you mean it's you guys? How do you know us? You, you were just you were just made. How do you know us? Yeah, we don't know you! You have all the memories of Nightmare Steve's? What?! As the adventure continued, Blue Steve would come to be Rainbow Steve's closest friend. This Blue Steve aspired to one day become an Elder Blue, just like his past ancestors. He believed that going on this journey with Rainbow Steve would help him achieve that goal. What? What, what is it? It's a... It's a, a Steve temple? What's a Steve temple? Wait, it looks really... Really weird. Look at all this. Come in here. It's like all marble with like weird leaves and like waterfalls and stuff like that. They were just recently made. What do you mean? Who made it? Whoa, up here looks awesome. Okay, it was recently made. That's cool, but like, who made it? The Elder Steve? What? Who are the Elder Steves? I'm, I'm so confused, Blue Steve. You're not really, like, telling me anything. The, the wisest. You hope to be one day. What, you want to be an Elder Steve? Oh, wait, what's, what's an Elder Steve exactly? What do they do? They're smartest, okay? Well, what makes them the smartest? And like, do they have like any extra powers? Like, are they like, I don't know, like you, where they can fly around and they, I don't know, do all sorts of stuff? They're blue steves that grow old? Wait, so there's no like, elder red steve or green steve or anything like that? Maybe the strongest of the original colors. And so he decided to ensure Rainbow Steve's goals would be achieved as well. But what was Rainbow Steve's goal? Rainbow Steve had heard about a legend of the artifacts. Powerful items that, if separate, have great power and potential, but if collected and all are put together, would make the user unstoppable. Rainbow Steve had believed that collecting all of them would be the only way to defeat Nightmare Steve, and he would soon come to obtain a few of them, getting ever so close to being able to defeat the evil of his time. Um, let's see here. Oh, there's redstone down here. Oh, okay. Alright, and... Oh, I was stuck! Rainbow Steve? 
slipped. Are you okay? Oh, I'm fine. Um. <gasps> Blue Steve. Blue Steve, Why? come down here. Why? I What's down there? I think I found it. I think it's the altar. Oh, okay, I'm coming. Oh, that was quick. Hey. Look. Oh. Oh, I guess oh. we just dropped the redstone in here, huh? Okay. Yeah. Well, should we turn it into blocks, or is it okay to just use it regularly? Um, well, we don't have a we don't have a crafting table to make into blocks, do we? Yeah, I guess let's just throw it in as a regular regular redstone. I mean, redstone didn't say anything about turning them into blocks, so yeah, I don't think it matters. Um, oh, jeez, I almost fell in. Um, yeah, be okay. careful! It doesn't look like there's a way out. All right, I can't believe it. Uh, this will be it. We'll be able to get the red artifact. I can't believe yeah. it's that easy, though. But, um... All right. Hey, go for it. Ooh. Just throw it all in there. Uh, just throw it all in there? Yeah, go for it. Okay. Did it work? Um... Oh! Whoa! Oh! Ow! Whoa! Ow! Oh! What's happening? First, he had to ensure Dark Steve would be the first one to be defeated before being able to get to the evil king himself. Ow! Nightmare Steve will win. No, he won't. Once he realizes you're gone, we'll come after you next. Okay? You, you've already, you already tormented all my friends, and some of them I can't see again. But you know what? You're gonna, you're gonna pay for that. And here it is. <laughs> we'll see about that. Do it now! Huh? Ah! Huh? Is, is that it? Did I, did I do it? Uh-oh. It's gonna, it's gonna explode! Run! What do you mean it's gonna explode? It's gonna explode! Ugh. What? What happened? He exploded. I don't understand. I, I saw Dark... I saw... He, he disappeared or... He was destroyed or something? But then this explosion happened. It, he exploded! Like... Dark Steve had been working on an evil lair he built in the middle of nowhere on an island. There, Blue and Rainbow Steve discovered a secret that not even Nightmare Steve was aware of. A creation of Dark Steve's mind. Hypno Steve. Who are you? What? Huh? What's that sound I hear? What? So, this is what Dark Steve must have been hiding. But what are you? You, you don't... Yeah. What? Free Hello? Him. Free, free him? Who? I, I don't even know who this is. They could be free dangerous. Free him! Uh, no, thank you. I think I'm just gonna leave him in this little... Uh, Blue Steve? Blue Steve? What? You came out of nowhere. What are you doing? I said free him. No, I don't... I'm not gonna free him. I don't know who he is. Wait, no. Blue Steve, stop! Don't do that! Blue Steve, no! Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. What are you doing? Blue Steve, you don't realize what you just did! Oh no, there it is again. What are those whispers? Approach him. Uh, no thanks, I'm- Approach I'm... him. Hello? Excuse me, are you- Don't speak to him. Approach him. Uh, okay. You look so disfigured, you don't look- What? No. No. <laughs> Hypno Steve was in a sense the same as Rainbow Steve. Both created as a belief that they would be the key to ending the endless battles the Steves had been stuck in. Hypno Steve had also been created by a means of fusing unknown Steves together. At first, it seemed like he was completely evil, but eventually Rainbow Steve would come to see that he was only just lost and created out of anger. You have a lot to learn. Not everything in this world is so straightforward. What you're saying is, is there's more power into them? No. Oh. I'm saying there's less power. Wait, what? Less there's power? There's a lot less power in those artifacts than you think, Rainbow Steve. But yet they generate so much energy. How do you think that is? Where do you think that power is coming from? Think I, about that. I, Maybe one day you'll figure it out. No, wait. I think I get it. I think it depends on the person that's using it, right? I won't tell you whether anything is true or not. But I would love to see if you figure it out. What? I mean, it, it's me, isn't it? I can use this power and, and, and like, tap my, my inner power into it and the artifice will become stronger, right? Is that it? Do I have that answer? 
Maybe, but I still won't give it to you. You helped me figure out a lot about this world, but that doesn't mean I'm just gonna tell you everything. I need to keep that to myself. I don't have any allies in this world. Only people who help me, and people I'll eventually betray. <laughs> but I won't do that to you, of course. Right. <laughs> of course not. Oh, well, I hope not. I get the feeling we'll definitely meet each other again. You seem to attract a lot of attention. The two would come to have a bit of a frenemy situation, where they don't hate each other, but they knew that they were stuck in a fight handed down to them. At this point, Dark Steve had gotten away and regrouped with Nightmare Steve to move on to their next major plan. But Rainbow had gotten frustrated of this cat and mouse game that the two sides were playing. He and Blue Steve were able to find Nightmare and Dark Steve and witness the next plan come to action. <gasps> Blue Steve, Blue Steve. Hey, what's up? Where are we going? It's, it's, it's Dark Steve and Nightmare Steve. They're, they're literally right there. What are you talking? Oh my gosh. They are yeah. right there. We need to get closer. Can what's I get closer? What's going on? I don't why know. Are, why did the teleporter take us here? I don't know. Wait. Portal took us here for some reason. Nightmare Steve looks, that looks weird. It does look weird. What, what are those black parts on him? You failed to gather the artifacts. What? I can barely hear them, but I, I, I can make it out. This is not good. Why does Nightmare Steve look so different? I What's don't wrong know. with him? I don't know. The two evils had become even stronger. Dark Steve would transform into a hidden elder Blue Steve to lure unsuspecting Steves into traps to weaken the other side. What could they possibly be planning, Rainbow I don't, Steve? I don't know. But we can't be too loud, okay? You gotta keep quiet. You're right. You're right. You must be disguised as an elder Blue. What? what? An elder Blue? An elder Blue? Why would they disguise as an Elder Blue? There's no Elder it. Blues left anyways. Yeah, it's, it's, not, it's never gonna work. Gather all the Steves. No. No. Rainbow Steve, I know what's going on. And bring them to me. No. No. Oh. Uh, oh. That's... Rainbow Steve? That's Elder Blue. He disguised as Elder Blue. Rainbow Steve was frustrated. Without considering how outmatched he was, he rushed in to attack Nightmare Steve, but clearly wasn't strong enough. Nightmare Steve, this is it. I'm not gonna let you hurt any more people despite you, you know, absorbing the end crystal. I don't care how powerful you are, I will stop you. Well, well, well. You finally showed. I and mean, yeah, I, mean, I was gonna stay away from it for long. I'm gonna fight you and defeat you once and for all, Nightmare Steve. Just as no, so Steve, please. This isn't a fight you can win. Run! I can, I can do this. I, I, I think I can do this with the artifacts. Alright, Nightmare Steve. You're gonna get it, alright? And you're to lose! You sure about that? I've gained some power by absorbing that crystal. Yeah, I know about that, but it doesn't matter. I'm, I'm sure the, 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 this, the artifacts are better than this. I can do this. What? What, what can you... Whoa! Oh no. Boosie, are you okay? I, I can't Steve, get I'm to you! Fine. Listen, run into the jungle! Alright, maybe I can find him there. Oh, come on. Come and get me nowhere, Steve! Rainbow Steve, I'm telling you! He's too strong! He's... He's changed physically. The power he has inside of him is immense. No, I, I think I can beat him. The artifacts have to be stronger, right? Rainbow Steve, I don't know about that. The artifacts were probably designed to defeat him before he got the end crystal. It, it doesn't matter. I, I, I think they can do it. They're, they're much stronger. Just watch, okay? Uh, come on. Rainbow Steve, uh, that artifact isn't powerful enough yet. I'm feeling really dizzy. You've used too much of your energy. Rainbow Steve, oh, we need to calm down. All right, just... Okay, you are funny, Rainbow Steve. Did, does he know where we are? He no, probably he... saw us run in here. Rainbow Steve had gotten backed into a corner and was near his end, but at that moment, Blue Steve risked his life to save Rainbow Steve by absorbing Nightmare Steve's attack. No! 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 Blue no! Ah! no! Blue Steve, no! <coughs> Blue Steve, Blue Steve, are you okay? Rainbow... Rainbow Steve? No, hang in there. Wow. What a hero. Your friend got in the way. Blue Steve, are you okay? <coughs> I... I saved you, right? Yeah, you did. You did save me from that lightning. Even without powers. I... Even without powers. Blue Steve's journey would come to an end soon after, when he offered to let Rainbow Steve absorb the last of his power to be able to get stronger. Rainbow Steve was heartbroken. Rainbow Steve, I know what we can do. What is it? My energy is falling apart. But maybe I can still help you. Well, how can you help me? You are Rainbow Steve. Consisting of all the colors of the Elder Blues. Or the Elders, sorry. <coughs> all the Elders are made up... Well, they made you. 
If the Elder Blues have been keeping me alive, that means my connection to them is strong. May not be an Elder Blue myself, but you may be able to absorb me. What? Well, see, that's that's crazy. I'm not gonna I'm not gonna absorb you. That's no way. That I'm just running out, Rainbow Steve. I feel myself falling apart. I want to keep helping. You absorb me, I may be able to help you a little more. You'll be made up of the majority of Blue Steves. Meaning that even though you're consisting of all the colors, Blue Steves will be running through you as the strongest. Since Blue Steves are the closest to the origin of all... Well, of all of the Steves. Then, maybe you can be stronger. Really? I can be stronger? I'll always be there. In your heart. So then you... Never be fully gone, huh? Rainbow Steve, on behalf of all the Elders, on behalf of the Elder Blues keeping me intact, I give my energy to you to continue the fight for good, to find a solution, find the way, and never forget, you are a good person. I'll be with you forever. Goodbye, Rainbow Steve. At this point, Rainbow Steve was lost. He knew the enemy was still far more powerful and he had no idea how to stop them. As well as he had no one on his side to go to. His friends were gone. But then he realized his frenemy was still watching him. Rainbow Steve took one last chance and asked Hypno Steve for help, who in the past may have tormented him, still seemed to have a good side. Hypno Steve knew of a way for Rainbow Steve to become much stronger, but it would involve Rainbow Steve to go into a deep sleep for generations to come in order to gain it. Seven generations of the Steves will pass. You'll have to go into a hibernation. I've unlocked the power of hibernation to increase your power, but I will refuse to use it myself. I'm not really one to sleep on the job. Wait, hold, hold, hold on, hold on. I have to go to sleep for seven generations? But what about Nightmare Steve and Dark Steve? They'll, they'll take over the realm and everything. Do I just you want me to just stand by and sleep through all of it? Yes. I got no choice, do I? You've got no choice, Rainbow Steve. So Very rarely will I get serious, but I'll be serious for this one moment. And hold back every laugh I have for you to truly understand this situation. Seven generations will pass. Many will fall. Battles will be lost. Nightmare Steve and Dark Steve will prevail. It will be their land when you awake. It'll be up to you to fix it. But by then I'll I'll have enough power to defeat them? You will! You'll have plenty of power. He would also lose his memories of his past, along with other possible side effects. Rainbow Steve understood what he had to do and decided to trust Hypno Steve. He handed over the few artifacts he still had in his possession to Hypno Steve for him to hide forever so that no one else could get their hands on them. Here you go. Yellow artifact. The red artifact. The blue artifact. Like a fresh breath of air. This energy is absolutely amazing! Yeah, don't rub it in. I'll go ahead and make sure no one can find these artifacts. Now, at least until you return. But I won't let these arti artifacts be found until you get your memories back. Should you never get your memories again, the artifacts will be lost in time. Well, I guess it's... it's better than anyone else using them. Then... Hypno Steve put him into a deep slumber to miss all these future generations. To one day wake up in a new world with new powers and new people. Concluding the origins of Rainbow Steve. Well, like you said, it sure seems like the end of the beginning. Hopefully when you wake up, you'll be able to fight before the beginning of the end. Goodbye, Rainbow Steve. Goodbye. Goodbye! I banish you to the 8th generation of the Sneeves! I'll see you then! And when you awake, all your memories will be gone! But you'll be as powerful as ever! Goodbye! Huh? What is this place? Am I... Am I inside my mind? The sun is setting. And I want to keep going, but I can't move at all. I guess I should just relax and enjoy this view. For seven generations. That sure is a long time to pass.
Although I guess for me it'll appear as if it all happened in a split second. I sure wish I can keep my memories of his life. The green Steve that took me into his home. Professor Red asking me and Blue Steve for mushrooms. <laughs> you know. Looking back at it all, I really didn't appreciate those times enough. Especially now that it's all over. Trusting an unlikely ally like Hypno Steve is probably a long shot. But if I do truly want to defeat the people who want to take over this world, I need to become stronger. But... But I'm scared. I'll be all alone. You're never alone. Blue Steve? I is that you? You'll never be alone, Rainbow Steve. Never. Here's to the next adventure. The start of something new. And with that was the origin story of Rainbow Steve. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys want to see more story ofs, then let me know whose story you want me to go into in the next video down in the comment section below. Thank you guys for the support. Hit that like button, subscribe, turn on notifications so you can get my daily videos in your sub boxes. And as always, I'm your host, Saber, and I'll see you tomorrow with another daily Minecraft video. Peace.